the surferama now for the late afternoon heats. Looking over Hap's shoulder as he gives his analysis of the action. Michelle up and riding again. Wingnut, a good turn, and a leisurely stroll to the nose. Watch this casual foot paddle as Wingnut drops back in. Wingnut, granting yet another interview about Endless Summer 2. Michelle Genode again. He's magic on the nose. Nice looking Woody. With this tag, it can only belong to one person. The bull himself. Legendary big wave rider Greg Knoll, the man generally credited with riding the biggest wave in history. Joel Tudor, on his way to victory in the Surferama Finals. This is called Hanging Ten. Michelle Genode. Like I said, he's magic on the nose. The old boards remind you of the old days. Let's travel back in time now to the early 1960s and the birth of East Coast surfing in my hometown of New Smyrna Beach, Florida. Buddy Wright. Skipper Eplin. Gordon Smith. Thank you. 
The original members of the Smyrna Safari Club. Donnie Jolly, Gordon Smith, Ronnie Dreggers, Skipper Eplin, Bob Cade, Jimmy Smith, Lloyd Dreggers, John Harvey, David Tick Parker, Eugene Facey, Pete Blanchet, Billy Johnson, Charlie Lyons, Bruce Harris, Robert Wolf, Richard Parker, Buddy Wright, and Eddie Vaught. David Tick Parker, world class pro surf contest judge Mike Martin, claims that Tick was the most naturally talented surfer he's ever seen.